what is up and welcome back to another fantastic video here we are back in the world this beautiful beautiful world thank you all so much for the kind comments on the beauty that is my base i love it too i hope you all enjoy it as well the animals have started breeding quite nicely not gonna lie um our tree farms working quite well getting starting to get fill up and all that kind of stuff I've been feeding the animals and kind of breeding them a little bit and I started working on our next little area over here so I do want most of this to be pretty tight pretty uh, close together you know think of it kind of like supporting and whatnot um, I do want it all to be pretty close together but I think this right here is going to be our machine room and then I think right alongside of that we're probably gonna have our storage and crafting areas is at least my initial thought process of you know how this base is going to kind of progress out if that makes sense um, so just been doing some quick building nothing too crazy but I figured you know what I am getting so sick and tired of this right here this two two that's what I'm getting sick and tired of the number two in all its glory terrible terrible number no actually I want to be able to get more out of my wood is basically what I'm getting at here and to do that we're gonna need to actually progress in the pack I know right what what we're actually gonna build machines in this gameplay not just base yes indeed I do want to actually build some machines now to do this I do want to move these guys over um, I kind of want to set up a little bit of you know it's gonna be rough it's gonna be rough to begin with it is you know we're talking like this right here right this is exactly what we're talking about just like this okay so yeah nothing too crazy I haven't decided about the half slab thing I don't know what I'm gonna do there maybe we step up and go to the full I don't know it's tough it's tough with machines and everything they look out of sorts when you're got the half slab what do you guys think we could go down we could go up I don't know I don't know I don't know but next on our task list is the carpenter and it appears that I've also gotten myself a market geared up totally forgot all about that did they oh, they changed the texture for a pattern chest oh my I updated the pack that looks amazing I love it. I love it a lot. Anyways, market get. Let's do this first and foremost. I'm just going to throw this guy down right here. And the main reason I was getting that was for the capabilities of not only the quest, but to get things like soybean and stuff like that as we progress on. I think I said I was going to get the lunchbox at some point in time, but I've kind of decided against that at this point in time. So, yeah, we'll move on from there. Let's work on the carpenter the carpenter all right what do we need for this bad boy what do, what do we need to do what do we need to do we need treated wood planks and then we also need to get a basic coil with some redstonia okay i think we need only eight to get this done of the redstonia we also need some bronze mm. one two three four five six seven eight nine let's do a 12 and what three? Twelve and four. Ha 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 math. Ha ha math. Alright, let's do up that first. We'll get the longer one going. The redstonia we can definitely make. And I did make the black quartz that we require. Very good. So that'll go there. That'll be our basic coils. Now we also need to get ourselves some doo -doo -doo, some treated wood. Go. I honestly don't know how much we have in the tank. Oh, I filled it completely up. Oh, I'm so good. So good at this game. Oh, I love it when good things come together. Love it. Hopefully you guys are all having a fantastic time while watching this beautiful video. And thank you all so much for the continued support. The views, the support, the Discord has been hopping too. Love it. Feel free to jump in there comment on you know the videos throw it in there you know throw me the comments on youtube i love them there throw me the comments on twitch i love it 
I love it everywhere. Just throw them all. The biggest thing for me is like all of the um, Discord I can access at work. See, that's that's one of the things, right? So I can get Discord at work, whereas I can't get Twitter or YouTube or Twitch or any of that stuff at work. So I can chat with you guys while I'm working, which is awesome because, haha, why would I want to work? Why would I want to work? Exactly. All right, boom, boom. Oh, wow, we made 63. You what, mate? <laughs> okay. Uh, well, 63 is not going to fly in the slice. We're going to have to make that 64 because, yeah. Who in their right minds makes 63 or something? Okay, give me that bronze. Let's go. Let's go. Let's make this carpenter flow. Boop, boop. Bop. Okay, done. All right, 64. Excellent. Excellent. So I guess we just need to go convert the redstone, right? So we're going to go over to our atomic reconstructor. This guy right here. We're going to throw down. Uh, we're going to take off our lens. We're going to throw down the redstone. And we're going to give it a little zap. Turn it into the redstonia crystal. Now, you are going to go through quite a bit of this uh, over the next little bit. So doing a stack of the redstonia crystal, probably actually a good idea. Um, but around here, I don't do good ideas, so we're just going to do a bad idea and make ourselves a carpenter. Excellent. That should... One of two. One of two. Thermionic fabricator. We, may need, we need to make a thermionic fabricator as well. We need to do both. There's two parts to this quest. Oh, and that requires a circuit board. Okay, so yeah, that's the carpenter right there. But we need... Four gold gears? Oh my. That's expensive. Okay. Four gold gears. That's 16 gold. Oh, goodness gracious. That's a lot of gold. Okay. Well, you know what? It'll be okay, everyone. It'll be fine. I promise. It'll be okay. Uh, we also need a hardened casing which requires one of those sturdy casings so let's get ourselves a sturdy casing started up and i think the hardened is what four diamonds with that oh you know it's just it just hurts every time i look at the recipes they just hurt <laughs> it's like somebody stabbed me in the heart there's such a pain all right let's get that guy going right here boom boom, boom. oh wait no, that's just a standard craft. Okay. Blah, 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 blah. No? What? Oh, that's done in the carpenter. Well, then. We have a carpenter. We can do that. All right, let's get some of this gold, though, going. We need four golden gears. I'd like to get these done ASAP. Now, this guy here is also going to be another three gold. So we actually are going to be pretty much out of gold at this point, which is really not good. Not good in the slightest. Um, I like gold. I like having resources. I don't like running out of them. It's just in. Okay. You know what? These cherries. I can't wait till we get our pizza fully up and running. It's going to be so good. Okay. So we got that. We got that. We're going to need three gold and six redstone for that. Good. And beautiful amazing stuff all right good got that got that we're gonna need a crafting table i can make that we'll just make it out of the half slabs here convert them back there we go crafting table all right i think we pretty much have everything we just need to get this carpenter up and running don't we so let's just throw it down like that and let's just do that Throw up power in with the clockwork. I think this is probably the easiest and best way to kind of do this um, based off of what I know. Uh, we'll throw down this guy first with... We obviously need some water. Let's just make a whole bunch of water in here. I think most of, if I'm not mistaken, most of the recipes early on are going to be water-based. So that's fine. Okay, other than that, we will keep this going, keep it trucking. Good. 
We'll throw that in there and that's got to do some work. We got to do some work here. We got to get it done. The other items here, I'm going to get prepared in the crafting table so that we can complete our thermionic fabricator. That, that, right? What else did we need? Glass, circuit board. Uh, let's use this black stained glass. Why not? Circuit board and hardened, which are the two things that we're making over here. So, things are going decently well in the world. I'm very happy. The animals do tend to glitch through still. Um, whether it's a baby or an adult. So, I got the iron backpack last time. And just with the... I hotkeyed it to be I. Um, so that I can just hit I and it opens my backpack, which is super awesome. Um, it's absolutely amazing. I highly recommend having a good hot key in place for that. And this is taking forever. Come on. Come on, let's go. I want this circuit to be done. We need it to be done. Okay. I probably should have uh, geared this thing up first. Before we got going. Before we got going. Mm-hmm. You know what's delicious? You know what's delicious? Coffee. I love coffee. All right, so we got that. It's almost done. Please. Maybe. There we go. Okay, we got the circuit. Excellent. Okay, and then the hardened casing. Go. That's going to do its thing now. We got a bit of time. I'm going to sleep and we'll get that proceeded on. And then from here, we can start to look at the next quest as well. Um, I'm really, I'm really looking forward to hearing from you guys about the, the height of everything. And if we should do the half slab thing that we're doing right now. So next up, we do have flowing power. So I believe that's leadstone conduits. We also have the coal generator. Okay, so let's first take a look at the leadstone pipes. Okay, so it's a basic circuit. So that's a tin with redstone and some lead. Okay, let's fire up eight lead and two tin. We'll start cooking those guys up, getting that ready to go for our next step here. The tin, it will need one of them almost immediately. Along with, you know what? I'm going to take a stack over. I'm just going to take a full stack because we're going to probably just load up this carpenter anyways, right? So we'll do that with the stack, with the tin. Good. How are we doing on the power? The power is a problem. So that coal generator is probably going to be super awesome to get here right away as well. So let's take a look at that. Um, it looked like the actually additions one, and that's going to require six more gold plus another four. So that's another 10 gold. We do not have the gold for that at all. Um, generators in general. Let's take a quick look. Let's see, the survivalist we can make. Okay. The furnace... We can make the furnace generator. Extra utilities too. We can make the cul... No, we can't make the culinary. What about making a furnace gen from extra utilities too? That's not too bad. It's going to be a little bit iron intensive. But it's not too bad overall. I think that's going to be our way to go. And we're already making that extra lead. So that should work out quite nicely. I think the only thing in there that I saw was that we need a lead gear. So let's get that guy prepared in the smeltery here. So let's go four of you over into here and get that started to smelt up. Excellent. The bee is doing wonderful. Amazing. We have that. We have that. That's good. Let's just, you know, let's take that anyways over with us. We should have our hardened set up, which is good. I am trying to uh, basically be 100% out of food here before I eat my pizza. Because um, pizza is delicious and you want it on an empty stomach. All right, good. Hardened casing we have gotten. That's awesome. And now we can get ourselves 
a basic circuit board, or better yet, how about two? I think two is probably a pretty good idea for right now. We should probably make like 40 bazillion of them. I'm not going to lie. We're probably going to need a ton considering all of your basic power is going to be on this system. Okay. Good. Let's go get our thermionic fabricator and some power cables so that maybe we can power more than one of these things at a time, which would be very, very helpful. Okay. Thermionic fabricator. Not really... What was that called? Not really for wood number seven. <laughs> Some of these recipe names are actually pretty funny. I highly recommend reading them. There we go. There's our sawmill. That's the guy. That's the ticket. That's the ticket we truly need. Okay, let's do this and this with some redstone around the edges and get ourselves some power. Good. That quest is now done as well. Oh, baby. We are advancing like a beast we got two loot chests at the same time two diamonds whoa poggers that's nice that was very nice okay i like it i like it a lot okay the old coal generator and survival generator so we can definitely make the survival but i was kind of leaning more towards the furnace wasn't i aluminum gear with the refined circuit Oh, that's got a lot of iron casings. That is very iron intensive because each one of those is eight. So that's eight, 16, 32 iron plus another three. That's 35 iron total. Whereas this guy here, it's just eight, 16, and three. That's only 19 iron. Pretty big difference overall. Um, I am going to get myself the eight iron going over here for now. Yeah, I guess just for now. I'd rather have this furnace generator up and running before we start looking into other things here because I feel like bang for the buck, we are going to be more beneficial with that generator. Just call it a hunch. You know, I've never done this before, so we'll just leave it as a hunch. Okay, and then we're going to need another eight... And then I'm going to need another three, right? Okay. So eight will get fired up. We'll throw three up in here. That should do the job to get us our casings and our little dumahickey. You know, the dumahickey. And then we got some iron in there. Let's get... Let's get eight more. We got to get some more gears anyways, right? Like we got to... We got to get all these things going something fierce. Anyways. Got to get all these gears. Okay. Because that's going to lead us to casings, which I'm out of wood on. That's fine. Out of sticks. There we go. Yeah, we're going to need another eight on top of that. If we have to make that survivalist gen, right? That's going to take four gears. So, yeah, that's 16 iron. That hurts. That's a lot of iron, man. We've gone through a ton of iron already. And there's more on the agenda. That's crazy to think. Okay. We'll get that going anyways. While we make ourselves the iron casings here. We're at seven and three. That'll do the job for me. Ha ha ha. I know, right? I'm such a clever, smart guy. You know, it's really tough to keep up with my advanced linguistic skills. Um, I really take Minecraft to a next level. Um, you know, it's just one of those things, but we really try to advance the system around here. All right, let's get this fired up again. Bloop, all the way up to red. Let's go. Oh, my Lord. Why does it take so long? Why does it take so long? I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to just throw down some power like this. Just the four for now. That's going to lead directly into the atomic reconstructor. I'm going to eventually move the clockwork to probably be down at the end here along with the furnace generator. Just so that we can get all of these things going 100%. Uh, so that we're not running into any issues and we can run more than one machine at a time. No, oh, there we go. It's pizza time. 
It's pizza time. Get all that beautiful saturation. Love it. So much better than these cherries or this bread. It's unbelievably different. Okay, good. That's our furnace gen. Nice. Man, I hope I didn't goof that up. And then I'm going to work on a survivalist gen, I guess, as well. Yeah, I mean, we might as well. We might as well start working on it, right? That is one of the... I mean, it's not required. Let's look at what the sawmill takes here first. Let's let's just see. Can we just get the sawmill and call this done without doing the rest? We need some more lead. We need another basic iron casing, iron gear. You know what? I think I'm just going to do that instead. I think, I think, I think we're just going to do that instead. We already have ourselves enough for this, right? We can get ourselves the iron casing. I will need, is it three more pieces of lead? Yeah, it's four lead total. So I will need a little bit more lead um, right up there, but that's not a big deal. We need golden axe, golden axe. Oh no, that's our problem. I don't have the gold. I do not have the gold. Okay, we're gonna have to get some gold, ladies and gents. We are going to have to get gold. All right, and I'm also going to need a piece of tin. Holy cow, a lot of little things here. A lot of little things being required. Okay, the iron we need for this. That's going to give us our iron casing. Good, we got our gear. That's excellent. Uh, we have one lead so far. And there's the other lead going. Let's go start our basic circuit. Yeah, we'll pour out more gears. We're going to need them anyways. We're going to need them. But we need a lot more gold. And I think I'm going to have to go harvest that. Yeah, I think so. So, yeah, I guess I will uh, be back in a moment. All right. Well, not the best of mining trips, but I did manage to acquire six gold. Okay, and we got some iron and some more redstone and such. No diamonds that time, though, either. So, nothing too, too crazy here. Um, I just want to double check. Yeah, so it's the three. Okay, so we'll cook up all six. And then we will get ourselves the gold axes started to craft in the EFAB here. So, yeah, kind of a little bit of an intensive recipe, let alone the other generators you know, like the survivalist, we can definitely do now. We have the aluminum gear. Uh, I think we could probably pull this off now. Um, we should have all of the necessary iron, right? So that's two. Yeah, so we'll need four, right? Four gears for that. Yeah, four gears and an aluminum gear okay we should have some aluminum which we do excellent um all while we're getting this gold going boom okay start up the one 1 1.2 minutes Ugh. those ones kind of hurt a little bit not gonna lie all right so we have that we're going to need 16 total iron right yeah 16 total iron so we'll get that fired up in each one of those let's get that in there while those are crafting up, right, we can proceed back over here, get the gears going, and start at least working towards our survivalist gen, right? Uh, leave one behind. One guy left behind. Bloop, bloop. Good. Okay, we can put that up. Oh, well, my math was not good, but that's fine. Okay, let's get this. The one thing I will say, that EFAB is far from quiet. Super loud. Super loud. We might have to get some sort of a noise filtering something on it because, oh, so loud. Okay, so we got that. Let's get our aluminum melted or aluminium, depending on where you are from the world. All right, there we go. We'll get our aluminium or aluminum gear. We are going to need a little bit more sticks. One... Is it like this amount? 
Sure. Sure. Yeah. Looks to be about right. Okay, good. Uh, this iron is completing. That's nice. And we got one of the axes. So let's get our second axe going. This should be done and done. All right. Let me just double check. So four iron casings. We're going to need some tin and the aluminum gear. All right. We have one iron here. We're going to need two more iron. So we'll get those cooked up. And... Oh, yes. That's for that. Good. Tin. We need three tin. You know what? Let's just cook up a smooth eight tin. I think that that'll be advantageous for us overall. All right, good. So that, that, excellent. We'll get our intricate circuit going here right away with these guys, and then we'll come back for our golden axe and the tin production. And then from there, we should be pretty darn, we should be doing pretty good. We should be doing decently. Okay, we'll get this guy going. Um, we should probably get like a sink or something for this because this thing is going to become a pain to continually start up. But as you can see, the furnace generator is doing its thing. It does only generate 40 RF per tick, but it is pretty darn nice. It seems to be plugging along and burning through all my iron or all my coal nice and quickly to say the least okay there's our circuit board good it sounds like the other stuff is done so we should be able to head on over here and pick up a few items like our axes excellent let's first throw those in there for our sawmill amazing absolutely fantastic and our survivalist gen okay good so the survivalist gen will help us out overall um and the sawmill is going to help out even more so by a much larger margin so that is exactly where i wanted us to be right we are now at the point that i was like this is where i want us to be so I'm feeling pretty confident. We've made some advancements. It's a, it was a good little episode. And I'm very, very happy with the current ongoings of said episode. So, I think that that is going to do it for me today. Oh, look at this. <gasps> Sawmill. We can actually produce wood at a somewhat reasonable rate. How amazing is this? Cherry wood. We won't need nearly as much of you. But yes, we will. It's fine. Let's go. Let's go, Sawmill. Do your stuff. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Don't output. Don't put it in there. There we go, though. Four. So we're getting four per now. Excellent. We're back to vanilla Minecraft levels. And we also get all this sawdust, which is kind of nice. We can use this for paper, Fido Grow down the road. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, we can use it for the compressed sawdust and sticks. This is actually a fantastic source of sticks. Um, I believe that's what I ultimately started using it for in my last playthrough uh, quite a bit. So, there we go. We got wood. We got wood, ladies and gentlemen. And man, oh man, it kind of feels nice to get a little bit more advanced in the technological world. Just saying. It's not a ton, but it's enough. It's enough for me. Look at that guy just chugging along. We got all the power. This guy only uses 20 RF. Oh, that's a piece of cake. Sweet stuff. Thank you all so much for watching. I really do appreciate your continued support. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And uh, yeah, other than that, have yourselves a fantastic day. Whatever time of the day it might be. And uh, yeah, we got a lot to do. With all that wood now, we need to make ourselves a storage room and an empower room. And I've also thought about it, but we need to advance. We need to propel forward our tree farm out of the, the archaic ages that we are currently in over here. We need to get the loot from the trees to the storage, etc., etc., etc. 
All while feeding our animals and working towards some pizza. Man, exciting times over here in the Minecraft world. And I'll catch you all next time. Do we have grass yet? No? Bye-bye for now. See ya.